Welcome back to my Can I Beat Them All series. This is Moonlighter Part 4, and I have some exciting news. I actually got a new keyboard. Look at the fancy colored lights here. It's new to me, so it's not brand new, but my brother-in-law actually gave it to me since in the last couple videos my keyboard was exceptionally loud and I realized that it was hard to hear me. So this one, much quieter and you should be able to hear me talking and also hear the game and not just hear clicky clacky keys. So let's go ahead and get into part four. I remember last time my goal was to beat the first dungeon and I did not do that. I kind of figured that I needed to upgrade some stuff before I'd be able to defeat the first dungeon because I tend to get hit a lot. And I also thought it would be good if I got a weapon that I can attack from a distance. I'm thinking I want to get the bow and arrow. I'm going to add that to my wish list. We just need boundary rests and sticks. And it's only a thousand gold, which I have. And then I also want to upgrade my shop. So let's go ahead and go look for the items that I need in order to make a bow and arrow. Come buy my things. It's my favorite. My favorite wheat wearing lady. I'm sorry, man, I don't have any weapons for you. Those are expensive. <laughs> Yay, I've made all the money. And then hopefully I can get 9,000 so I can also make my bow and arrow. I feel like they should have names when they walk in and I can know my repeat customers. You know you want to buy them. You know, it's really, easy <laughs> to make these people buy my stuff. Just whatever I have down, they will buy it. Let's close. Sorry, lady. We are closed for the night. Oh, look at all that. Let's upgrade the store. Oh, here comes the builder. I can't tell if it looks any different. It really looks exactly the same on the outside. Ooh. Every visitor adds a generous tip to their payment. All right, I'm going to like that a lot. Oh, look, I have two chests. Ooh, do I have more stuff now? A new person. As a hawker, I've traveled the world looking for techniques to create objects that can inspire people. I need one more, a lot more sticks. A lot more sticks. Okay, let's go back to find more sticks. Uh, let's go forward. Oh, 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 I hate when it does this. Oh boy, so much. I love the little boingy sound that it makes. <laughs> Ooh, that's new. White stone. I just, I really need sticks. I don't remember how to get sticks. Ooh, I think these, these dudes give me sticks. Do they just give you vines? Oh, they do give sticks. Okay. Attacking from the side is a good method. Sticks? No sticks. The airbender. Looks good. There's new people now. Not having the same four NPCs walk into my store and buy the same things over and over and over again. Come on, you guys totally need that for some reason. Oh, that went so much faster. I think I'm going to upgrade my shop a little. I want to get the, ooh. Okay, I'm going to get a comfy bed because I think that that's going to help me have extra health. Yeah, I'm starting to think like maybe I should keep my stuff 
Okay, I'm gonna add that to my wish list. I guess let's go get more sticks. I want my bow and arrow. Ugh, just some of everything. Ah! Okay, this is uh, going badly. Why did it, how did I do that? I don't know how I switched my weapon. Oh boy. <laughs> how did I do that? My bad. Oh, I don't have my uh, health potions anymore. Okay, well, let's hope I don't die. Yay, all the sticks. Apparently I slept because <laughs> now I have extra health, not extra money. Oh, I'm so close. I only need three more. All right, one more thing to sell. Yay. All right, people. You gotta leave. I don't have anything left. All right, I'm getting much faster, probably because I know how much to sell everything for now. Make some more potions. I can upgrade my armor. So I need to save those to upgrade my stuff. I'm just like hiding in the bush over here. Oh, I swear you are lying. <laughs> you always say that you saw me in the dungeon, but there's nobody there. Three more branches is all that I need. A lot more. I think they're called, I don't actually know. I call them flint, but I'm not sure what they are. And then I could make the big armor suit and then I'll, I'll be way better off to fight this golem. <gasps> Yay, sticks. <gasps> There's the sticks I need. Okay, now that I don't need sticks, look at what's popping up. All these little slimy dudes. But isn't that just how it works, you know? When you need something, you never find it until you don't need it anymore. Wow, you were just carrying everything, huh? You know, these little laser guys remind me of the Breath of the Wild. The turret dudes that track you and shoot lasers at you. Okay, ooh, this one's impressive. All right, let's go back. I finally got my sticks and I think I got enough flint. Let's go see. I think they're called teeth stone. For some reason, it looks like flint. You look well. Do I? Because I just got out of this crazy dungeon situation. Yes, us craft the iron chest plate. Woo! And then I want, yes, training bow. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to put this on. You have no idea. <gasps> Look at me. You know, the broom is cool and all, but bow. Welcome, how are you? All right, I'm going to, ooh. Okay, I should probably upgrade this so I get 20 defense. Oh, I need money. Dang, four. And that's almost all my money, but then I can make more money, so it's okay. I feel like I am ready to take on the Golem Dungeon, almost. Let's make some more money and then we'll talk about it. Oh. Should I sell my broom? I could. I don't know if I should though. Maybe I will sell my broom. Not sure how much for. Broom spear, oh, it's probably not a lot. Let's do like 15, but you never know. Somebody may want it. She went right for the broom. Let's see. Oh no, I sold it for too little. <laughs> oh, my poor broom. I'm just giving it away, I guess. Well, I think you scammed me, so no wonder why you're back. Sorry, lady, we just sold out. I can upgrade my stuff. Let's enchant that. Should we try and defeat the Golem Dungeon? I think so. Let's do this. Oh, this is nice. last room I go to is going to be the golem. I feel like now that I'm trying to defeat the golem, you can't find him. Ah, uh, here we go. I've definitely got five health potions. Let's swap to the bow and arrow. I think that that is going to be a better weapon for me. That is in case of death, but hopefully I will not die. All right. Oh 
no. Let's heal. I am bad at this time. Yay! I did it. Oh, can I get rid of those? Dang. Oh, well. I picked up everything else I wanted. All right, it was much easier with the bow and arrow <laughs> than with the sword. What is this? Oh, so I put stuff in and then I get gold. Oh, okay, so this is basically what I was just asking about. So I can put that there and then boom, and just keep going. Oh, you can fire lasers at me? Was there another golem? I'm not ready for this. Laser monster, go away. Okay, what do you have? <gasps> no! All right, there is in fact more than one level of the Golem Dungeon, and I did not know that. So I made it down the first level, so that was good. That would lower my speed a little bit, but it would give me 25 health on my wish list. Okay, perfect. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the stuff away that I need for my items. Oh. Look at that. And then I'll go ahead and put everything else away. All right. And I think with that, I'm going to go ahead and end this part right here. So thank you so much for watching part four. Um, I feel like this one was just kind of a, a grindy park. I have a new armor. I got my bow and arrow. I defeated the golem. So I did everything that I wanted to do. I even upgraded my shop a little bit. And I'm looking forward to keeping going and maybe next time we can get some of these of the shop people and then maybe upgrade my cash register. So thank you so much and I'm ready for the next video. Yay!